Welcome to the den, everybody. We're getting back to the Spurs season. Where I'm I'm declaring it. Brandon Ingram is gonna win MVP. You know this, I know this. At center, Mitchell Robinson. Sound alerts, I'm not worried about you right now. All I'm worried about is busting the Knicks ass. Because they did my boy Evan Fournier wrong. That's why he's on Spurs. Hopefully he gets on the actual Spurs. We'll see. How's everybody doing today? Woke up late again. Is what it is. I've been meaning to get back to 2K. We've had a couple bad streams where the connection died, so I'm hoping it doesn't happen this time. Uh, I don't know how this game's gonna go. Every game's been kind of close. But, uh... If I get a decent lead, I'm gonna rest some guys. I tried to rest my guys against Utah, and Utah almost beat my ass, so... Dylan Brooks! Drummond. Shout out to Andre Drummond. The beast on the glass. Bust your ass. DeJounte Murray represented the Spurs in the All-Star game. Coach Popovich said you start getting to that. He still ain't retweeted me. But I challenged him on 2K. Let's go, Drum. Let's go. And it's as much mental as it is physical. He's just growing by leaps and bounds in every way. Kevin? He is. We see it all the time. Tremendous. Hey, David, thank you. Bulls better play my guy this year. I'm a, I'm a boycott of Bulls. I said it. Then it's Jalen Brunson. And it's Grimes in at the two. Jalen Brunson's a good player. I like him. I actually did experiment having Randall on the Spurs. I'm still looking into it, but... No doubt, these are some tough-nosed, gritty, physical defenses. And Give me that ball, man! You got lucky, and you know it. You work. Now here's Barrett trying to claw his way back after a terrible showing in that loss to Dallas. I don't know if I should put Dylan on Barrett or Dylan on Brunson for real. The season for them to go up against this Knicks team. Yeah, a pair of losses for them in their meetings last season. Hey, what's up? I don't know who the best player on the Knicks is. I mean, I'm sure it might be like a heated debate, honestly. Shit. Man, let me see that shit. Because, I mean, I'm sure people probably say Brunson now, but RJ, I mean, I don't know. I know there's some loyalists to RJ Barrett. I guess I'll call that. Oh. I would say Brunson's probably the best player. So, even though I think that Jonte's a better defender than Brooks, I'm doing great. I'm down to one point, though. I could be doing better. <laughs> and I got, uh, I'll put Murray on, uh, Barrett. Barrett's basically a shooter, from what I understand. 
Richard, one of the greatest coaches in the history of pro basketball, a guy you played for, great pop. Kevin Ingram on Randall is interesting. May I put, or, or is Randall the best player? I mean, who is the best player on the Knicks? I don't know. Maybe I should have uh, Dylan on Randall. Have Ingram on Barrett and Murray on Brunson. <laughs> I think he would say that's completely not Shit. true. But uh, he had to be he had to be one of the great coaches you played. With. It, it was we'll have to my see. career got extended because of the things that I learned in San Antonio. If I wouldn't have had that experience with him and their coaching staff, I would never have played as long as I did. I'll pick you up. I'll pick you up, Mitchell. I'll pick you up. You know, Richard, at this point, that's something Drummond would do. I can feel it. I feel it. Yeah, well, and let's just say most years he doesn't disappoint. He's going to go down as one of the greatest rebounders in NBA history. He's physical and determined. Playing this, uh, I might play one or two games. I don't know. Let's see how this one goes. Nice. Oh um, man, uh, I put a poll on uh, X to see if I should play San Andreas or some other game. I got a bunch of solo games playing, so. It's so overwhelming picking a new one, so hopefully someone comments on it. Kicks it out to Van Vliet. Ah. It I don't know what's going on, my boy Freddy. I've been shooting horrible lately. Damn, really? And here's the fast break. Randall Fuck you, Julius. And out of bounds as the Spurs gain possession. And a chance now to see how teams are faring across I gotta make a decision here. The latest edition of the power rankings. Taking a look at Philadelphia. They slide down to the third spot, trying not to slide any further. Well, I, I don't know who's gonna come out. We've had some good game against Miami. I'm kinda hoping for a Miami reunion. I haven't faced them in the finals since this whole dynasty started. Yeah, damn it. Hey man, come on, shot meter, work with me here. To the inside, and it's set back. <laughs> what are you trying to do, bro? You didn't know the big penguin was down there. Oswald Cobble block. I gotta see that block again. They better show that. Please show that. Something in my eye. There we go. Hopefully they show that block later. That was sick. He's had great form and, and continues to look hot. And you look at the way Ingram can get off his shot. When he gets to his spots, there's just no stopping him. Very all right, let's put Murray on Brunson. And at the line, it's all about consistency. <laughs> Go! He's too small, Ingram. Yeah! He's too small. You're too small, Jalen. You're too small. You ain't 6'8". Calm down. Sit your ass down. You might weigh the same as Ingram, <laughs> but that don't mean nothing. <laughs> yeah, he mad. Look, he mad. He mad. He's John. He's John. <laughs> Look at that sad motherfucker. Ah. All right, Dylan's going to get on Randall. Ingram, you're going to guard Grimes. Actually, I'm going to put Ingram on Barrett. Maybe. I'll put Van Fleet on Barrett. Can't forget my boy. Ah. Damn. New York moving it around. Someone shoot, jeez. Could put Van Fleet on Brunson. Yeah. Barrett against Van Fleet. And the dunk by Robinson. All right, all right, calm down. His vision plays with a good recognition and been very unselfish. Now here's Murray playing Oklahoma City. He was huh. nearly unstoppable. Nothing seems to be going his way this quarter. Yeah, straight up, guys. Like, he's ice cold, like freezing. What's colder than cold? But 
You don't have to shoot it, my guy. It's okay to pass the one of nine. Ooh, a little extra on that one. He does. He doesn't usually finish soft either. Obviously, he can when necessary, but not that time. Robinson with the block. Handle with the ball. All guarded by Murray. And it's Brandon Ingram with the foul. What? That is his first foul of the game. First I don't know what happened there. Ingram, you're on Barrett. Then Fleet, you're on Brunson. Murray, you're on Grimes. Ah! That's what DeJounte did in practice with the Hawks. I saw it. I saw it on Instagram. Go follow DeJounte Murray. He'd be balling in the gym. Him and Trey Young. And he recovers it. Some solid defense from Ingram. Get up, Brunson. Quit flopping. You know you flopping. You know you flopping. Boy, it's a joy to watch Ingram as he's developed. One of the hardest working players in the game. So it's the Knicks now. After the basket by San Antonio. Seventeen footer and another basket. <laughs> oh, shit. Man, you see the Let's go. From Ingram Look at that purr. Look at that. Every level. His versatility is a Yeah. And the Knicks decide Let's to go. Their first time out here. Knicks actually beat the Cavs. My boss at work, he was sad about that. His Cavs are the Cavs are his team and the Knicks busted him. <laughs> He's still mad. <laughs> we did pick up the Cyberpunk G Fuel. It should be coming soon, hopefully in time for Fan Liberty. It better be coming soon, six dollars shipping. <laughs> Shout out to G Fuel. Right now we're doing the Snow Cone G Fuel. It's okay. We've had this one and the Naruto one and the Angry Joe one, of course. The Angry Joe one's probably the best one I've had so far. I wanted to get the Cyberpunk one, not only because of the DLC coming out, but because of the, uh, it's a fruit flavor. And uh, these two are not fruit flavors, and they're kind of just artificial tasting, but the Angry Joe one was a really good apple flavor. The Cyberpunk one has, like, three fruits in it, which is, it sounds intimidating, but hopefully it tastes good. We'll have to see. Shout out to G Fuel for liking that tweet. Oh, wait, what do you call tweets now? X's? <laughs> Come on, Elon. Get your terminology down, bro. X still redirects to Twitter.com, too, so I don't know what Elon's just waiting. I don't know what he's doing. I don't know what the hell he does. All I know is it's a tie game. We're going to come back on him. 34 0, Knicks. You ain't got it. You ain't got it in you. You ain't got it in you. Guys like him, you have to watch to understand his impact. We always got the rosters up to date. That's why it sometimes takes a little longer to start streaming because I had to look up the Knicks' projected lineup. They did. They re signed Josh Hart, good player, to a huge extension. They got uh, Dante DiVincenzo from Golden State. They uh, otherwise stay the same. Offensive rebound. Ah! So they're mostly running it back, honestly. Which is probably a good idea. Stephen A. Smith was calling for uh, Julius' head, though. So I don't know. I could see some trades happening. They really don't have much bench. Not that Thibodeau knows what a bench is, but that's the sad point. They haven't been able to attract top-level talent for quite some time, which is surprising when you consider this big market Damn. and the status this franchise has within the city. And, and the putback? The Damn, please, sit, sit down, bro. You, we got to get you with, uh, we got to rehire Chip England <laughs> and have him train you real quick, bro. Because you shoot horribly. And I don't understand it because... I don't always have a perfect release with Ingram, but the shot meter goes to exactly the same place on, on some of Van Fleet's shots that Ingram's shots do, and his don't go in. So it's like, I don't know what's going on. But Ingram's shots go in. 
Josh Hart. Lakers should have never gave him up. <laughs> Lakers don't always make the best moves. They did get Christian Wood, though. I need to tell my Lakers friend uh, about that. That would be good for them. This for hitting shots now. There's 138 left in the first. Give me that ball. Shit. Picked up by Drummond, and DeJounte Murray gets the whistle that time. That's his first foul. There's some changes here for the Spurs. Collins checked in for Andre Drummond, and it's Richardson in for Fred Van Vliet. Murray against Quickly. Oh. Almost. Picking up that Damn! They're not going to show Drummond's block? I mean, that was a good block, too, but Drummond's block was amazing. All right, Tyus. I really do like my team I made. It took a lot of maneuvering and lots of trades and lots of financial implications, but Jordan Hayward's been great for us. So has uh, Tyus Jones. So he's kind of in a slump right now, but... We're trying to get MVP. You see Ingram's numbers went down a little bit. We had a week or so of games where I wasn't quite getting to 30. Woo. He'd probably make that in real life. <laughs> I ain't complaining, though. Take it, Dylan. Take it. Shit. Hartenstein, what are you doing, bro? What are you doing? Stop. Fuck. I don't know what's going on with these reaching fouls because my players aren't even trying to go to the ball. Like, the ball is over here, and he's like, Ugh. <laughs> Like, bro, go for the ball at least. Man. Just remember, y'all were down one before that free throw. That's all I'm saying. And the Spurs with possession. The Fox should be on last night, or should be on tonight, I mean. Apparently, he called off at work yesterday, but he forgot He forgot how to text the Wolf. So, <laughs> we could have played last night, because I was awake, and I was up doing stuff on Twitch. But he, he thought I was online on PlayStation, so he messaged me on there. I'm like, bro, always text me, like, because in reality, my stuff was on rest mode. Um... So missed opportunity there, and now I feel like crap because I'm like, dang. We could have played last night. Oh, shit! Yeah, I see you, Tyus. I see you. Starting point guard. Wizards this year, hopefully. Uh, yeah, he might. I might not got it off in time. If I'm being honest. I think he got it off in time. Oh, I did. I did. Ne forget what I said. We got it, boy. Say hello to the people, boy. Look here, boy. Look at that gut. We gotta talk about your gut, okay? You're getting tubby, okay? But you're growing, boy. You like your window? You like the window, boy? You got the cord all up on you, boy. What? How'd you do that? A little destructor over here. When you have it there, you gotta use it. Brandon Ingram. He's been the guy making things happen for the San Antonio Spurs. Between his points and his rebounds, he was a star for him in that quarter. We'll take a quick break and then back to the action here. Yes, sir. The only spur of the three. Drummond has won MVP twice. Murray's won MVP once. Ingram was right there with Drummond one of the years Drummond won. Drummond won twice. And one of the years Drummond won uh, Defensive Player of the Year, too, which uh, puts him in, up with there with, I think, Hakeem and a couple other guys. But uh, Ingram's never won it. And then I, that's when I started like trying not to have Ingram anymore and kind of a dark period. 
but uh, we got Ingram back, and we're 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 doing really well with him. I think part of it was some of the other two Ks they weren't so good at what Ingram's good at. But uh, this one I'm able to do more fadeaways and stuff. Come on, Collins. You were right there, bro. The MVP rankings haven't come out yet. Shout out to Dylan Brooks. On the backboard for him. I mean, it's what we Hopefully it's a good season in Houston. I think he's a good player. He's putting the work in. He's trying to get better at shooting the ball. And he plays with heart. That's all I can ask for in a team and player. And he actually plays defense, so... I know Memphis kind of did him wrong, and he kind of made it worse, but... Shout out to Dylan Brooks. Hopefully he has a good season, good career. At least he wasn't afraid to take to LeBron. LeBron's got he'll he'll wind up respecting that later, but Dylan's kind of a character. Which, which kind of upset LeBron. I can see it, but but you know D Dylan's like I don't care. You know he's old. So he's a little little petulant, but you know. That's how he's trying to get LeBron's head, you know. It's all psychological, so. I don't know. Go, Dylan, go. Go, 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 go. Go, boy, yeah! And the toughness of Brooks on display. Not very contact when he's to score inside. Ah, we got to get his stats up. I might put Otto out. I might change Otto to small forward and put Gordon out after Ingram because Gordon can play the four too. That way Dylan gets his points up. Because <clears throat> lots of the time I'm putting Gordon out there for scoring. So Dylan's numbers are down compared to what he actually does. What are you doing, bro? Hi, <clears throat> Lady Wolf. What? It's going. My hill gold, he got upset. I thought I was showing everybody's gut. Well, he's a growing boy. Okay, but <clears throat> all he wants is toys. Intermission to get go with these toys. Let's put out a couple of them. Trampy. <clears throat> How old is he? Like seven? Six? He likes his toys though. He's still a baby. You can eat everything we can't eat, boy. <laughs> no. Get your fish, boy. Me and Ari had some fish. <laughs> All your toys, boy. There you go. Okay. <clears throat> Giraffe. There you go, buddy. Hey, have fun with your smile cord. Okay. <laughs> leading by four. Outside Porter. 
Damn! Hey, the, the shot meter on Superstar is not as forgiving as uh, on All Star. And there's the foul. It's on Jalen Brunson. Second. That'll be his second foul of the game. And you'll quickly, he's checked in for the next. <laughs> Me like your toys, boy. And so it's San Antonio with it. Jones for three. Ah! I was feeling that shit. <laughs> The thing I like about Superstar is the score is more realistic. Like, it's a close game for longer and more shots don't fall, so it's it's more realistic in that sense. J. Rich! Miami bound. IRL, but he's a Spur in this one. I actually got him right before the Spurs actually did, so lots of times that happens. <laughs> I, I want a player, and then the actual Spurs got that player over the years, which is funny. Over quickly. Ah. Okay, Randall. And again, unable to change momentum here. Outside, Jones. Now, here's Richardson. Damn. Closely. Comes up empty down low. New York shooting just 34% from the floor. Handle with the ball. He's picked up by Collins. Pass to quickly. Some nice passing by New York here. One of you motherfuckers got to shoot. Here's Barrett. A dependable source of points for his team averages just under 24 points a game. He's been held scoreless tonight. Really just unable to make any sort of impact. Now here's Jones. Seven oh, Jones Otto! Selfish player with a strong understanding of the wireless that knows how effective a good pick and roll can be. <laughs> New York calls timeout. Spurs girls. You happy bubba. <clears throat> now you get happy baby. <laughs> A $36 million man. <laughs> we needed Gordon, though. We needed a player like that. Even with the finance. It's only one year of financial implications. If it stays exactly the same as it is right now. You take a look at Ingram. And at number four in the West, he's almost certain to take part in the contest this year. He's going to be excited to let those long range shots. You're going to miss that, Randall? Damn. Damn. He's deadly from beyond and he has to be in this contest this season. And we'll keep you posted as we find out more and as we get closer to the three-point contest once we have our final list of official contestants. Yeah, it's going to be very... All right, give that back to Josh. That's one thing we all know, we've, we've got an incredible group of long-distance shooters in this league right now. Collins trying to break... There we go. Richardson, good. Richardson's got the lead up to 11 now for the... Oh! For Hart and ah. Richardson on the assist by Collins. And it's seven points for Josh Richardson. And let's get your take, guys, and the hustle stats for the Spurs. Too fast. He's shown to be a game changer on the floor. The, the problem for him has been staying on the floor. It has fought the injury bug his whole career. Now, here's Richardson. He's got seven. Hayward can hit. Randall with the ball. He's picked up by Collins. Randall passes to Quickly. Woo, let's go. Collins. Jones against Randall. Releases. Quarter, no luck. For Collins, he has yet to play close to a full slate of games, Greg, in a single season. 
Dallas has Dallas. missed time in Dallas. each Dallas. season Dallas. he's played. He, he's young Dallas. enough. Dallas. A few years of good injury Dallas. fortune Dallas. can Dallas. change Dallas. the narrative. And let's just hope that's the case. Got Brandon Clark back. San Antonio making a switch here. Hopefully he has a good season. And so it's New York with it. Back healthy. Following the miss by Otto Porter. I would like to see him against Lakers last year, but he got hurt. Another player that plays hard. Oh, uh, get some. My players' percentages are dropping down to almost normal, normal percentages now because on All Star, I was just shooting my lights out, which is really strange. So this is a weird 2K. It's got good things and bad things, and the good things mostly outweigh the bad things. I never thought I would play on Superstar, but it's been really good so far. Damn! Come on, ref. <clears throat> Found on my guys. Hey, look, I'm not gonna lie here. That's a shot that he needs to be making. There are no excuses. No. The pass. Shit. Here's Roby, the rim rattling two-handed jam. That's a double whammy, guys. <laughs> That's right. A great defensive play. Then the embedded stuff. Damn. Porter, solid shot from the distance of about 14 feet. Porter's got seven. He was inside his own head in that first quarter. You could see it. Now he's doing a much better job of letting the game come to him. Hartenstein, nice pass, nice catch, and a resounding dunk. Tall motherfucker. <laughs> Incredible reverse throwdown. Excellent body control. Hey, guys, I'd even go as far to say that was a punctuation dunk. Now here's Porter. Seven points in the game. <laughs> And we haven't seen them be quite as aggressive driving the basketball, settling far too much. Ah! Hart, no good. And so it's Porter bringing it up now for the Spurs. They're leading by eight. They want to keep rolling here following the win against the Thunder. Oof. Mental tough. Short arm. The, road. the arena was rocking, but they just got down to business and never let up. And the mental game you talk about, a lot comes down to coaching. Let's go. We got Murray back out. Let's go. We got to dunk on somebody's head. Let's go. All right, who wants it? Who wants it, man? Who wants to dunk on your head, huh? Just like in the practice video, baby. Ah, yeah. Where's my foul, ref? Quit messing with me. Brunson scanning the floor. Plenty of room tonight. Dang, he hit that shit. Okay, 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 calm down. Ah! After this game is over, I'm gonna tinker with the free agents and put uh, Christian Wood on the Lakers and put uh, JaVale McGee on the Kings. Check Spurs, eh? Retro era. I do not envy those young men going into the locker room right now. Kevin, back to you. Thank you, David. We'll be back after halftime for the start of the second half momentarily. Thanks for joining us. Brandon yeah. Ingram has been lighting Ingram, up baby. Like performance in the first half. They've been dialing his number, and he's answered the calls. His teammates know he's feeling it. Credit them for being unselfish and getting him the ball. Feed him every position. The big dog is hungry. You know about big dogs being hungry, man. You are the big dog, and you stay hungry, even today. And guys, a look now at who's been really lighting it up from outside the arc. There's some great shooters on this list, obviously. I wish I could have had a few more cracks at this event, man. I would have loved to take home that trophy. Hey, 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 Chip. You got the rings, man. That's all that really matters. Rings or the three-point contest. Let me think about that. And that is a wrap. Now let's send you back to Kevin Harlan for the start of the third quarter.
and happy you could join us. We've got two quarters left to go in regulation. Brandon Ingram has been sensational. He's done a fantastic job of finding open space to operate within the first few quarters. I like how they came into this one with the game plan, and they're just going out and executing it. Terrific job. Here's who Tom Thibodeau is starting the second half with. The forward spots will be Barrett and Randall. Then it's Robinson. Then it's Jalen Brunson. And it's Grimes in at the two spot. And there's the call on Gordon Hayward. That is his first foul of the game. All right, what are you doing, boy? Why are you grabbing cords for? You wild animal. Where are you going, Brunson? What the fuck you doing, man? Brunson, no good. Crazy man. He smoked it. Everything was set up for that to be an easy dunk. Yeah! Thread the needle. Very smooth play by Murray, working his way around the contact. For the smooth operator. To the wing right side. Here's Grimes. Arr, get that out of here. What? The dish to Robinson. I thought Clark got that. And that's good. Robinson picking up About time, RJ. Shit. Can you making how much money again? Like that. In the short break in the action gives us a chance now to send it over to David Aldridge. Thanks very much. Now, for 22 straight years, San Antonio made the playoffs. They haven't made the last three postseasons. And former Spur Robert Corey worries if they'll ever be made. Saying, I hate to say that. San Antonio is a small market. The guys just aren't going to go there. And that's a dire prediction for such a storied and successful franchise. Kevin. Yeah. Right, Three on Murray. Greg, you know this. One of RJ Barrett's dad's best friends, former MVP Steve Nash. Oh, yeah, and Nash is RJ's godfather, no less. So Barrett's had a chance to kind of soak in the game his entire life. And you can see that in his intelligence. There we go. Shout out to Freddie V. NBA champ. And Randall throws it down. And didn't do anything fancy there, but did He's pulled off some great comebacks for us. Always hits the craziest shots over the years. Shit. And they get it back. Van Vliet outside. And here's Brooks from outside. Drops in the train. Brooks has got six. And great find by Van Vliet. I'll never forget. I don't know what 2K was on, but I was down by like 20 plus, almost 30, I think. And they just kept, kept like regaining the lead every time I tried to cut into it. And then Van Vliet just went off. I'll never forget that game, hopefully. And it was just crazy. Came back from all the way down. And I think I've got it, a blog entry for it in one of the blogs, but. It was nuts. Van so shout out to Van Fleet. And you could tell Always spearheading those crazy ass comebacks. Passes to grind. A shot's good on the assist by Brunson. Brunson Catching up. Three assists in the game. Here's Van Fleet. And we're going to have a jump ball. It's tied up there. And that kind of style. Hey, calm down, up, Randall. Defense needs another look. And this is why coaches stress the importance of defense. Big block there in this close game. And here's Barrett. Seven points in the game. Here's Grimes. That misses at a chance to tie it there. And Van Vliet, here we go. Just under three and a half minutes play here in the third quarter gotta find easier shots when you're already struggling that's not gonna get it Robinson with it 11 points in the game Robinson dishes to Barrett can't tie it up as that one's no good San Antonio leading by three Murray right side Brooks outside Again, the miss by the Spurs. Well, despite some uneven shooting, fuck. And the 
Shanti Murray gets the whistle that time. That's his fourth foul of the contest. And now only one away from being in the middle. Jones checked in for DeJounte Murray. And New York with a change here, too. And you will quickly, he's checked in for R.J. Beer. Getting lucky. San Antonio's won a less than productive two of six from three-point land in the second half. Let's go. And it's Brooks. That time on the assist by Jones. Brooks has got eight points. He doesn't take a lot of time to make up his mind. Brooks always thinking ahead, and he's in position before the pass. Okay. Just the kind of play Ingram couldn't quite elevate. So I don't count. I don't count. I said it don't count. That's the kind of play that can energize the whole team, and they will take it in a close game like this. Now here's Ingram. Shit. He came over with the help defense and blocked it. Damn. That is his first foul of the game. Wow. Drummond's checked in. Hey, Richard, as soon as your playing career ended, you got right into this business, into broadcasting. When did you decide that this would be the next? Uh, well, the first time is when I thought I was going to be. Y'all still down, but don't be, don't be, don't be getting confident. Uh, until I retired in 2018, so it started way before. Good, uh, Tyus, get it. Good job. All right, a chance to check out the stats for DiVincenzo. Throwing Evan out there. And, and you love his anticipation. All those steals. He's always a step ahead, reading plays before they develop. His nose uh -huh. for the ball has never been better, Greg. And his transition no. defense really stands out. If you get careless in the open court, to four, yeah, 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 yeah. Calm down. Right in this, we'll see if they can maintain momentum. Things are firing on all cylinders for them right now. We'll see if they can keep it going. And he gets contact and the whistle on the shot. Two shots coming up. Not fouling, bro. He's good at seeking out contact and finding ways to get to the line. And let's take a moment, guys, to get your take on the scoring so far for the Spurs. And he knocks down the first one. Yes, sir. Oh, he shit. <laughs> Don't shoot free throws with your phone in your hand. And that won't go, missing the go ahead bucket. San Antonio's going to less than productive two of six from three point land in the second half. They're whistled from. Yeah, yeah, block foul. What? What? Mmm. No, head to the line. He shot well from the line. Careful, babe. No, you fail. 13 foul. Knicks. Damn! No, no good. Second personal foul. And he's good on the second. Next trail by three. Quickly with it. Jones covering. Down low. Stolen by Brooks. It's Ingram on the wing. Defended by Hart. A fader. Shit. And it's Ingram missing. The Knicks have gotten half their shots to drop in the second half up to this point, going 7 of 14. Three pointer, Randall. Basket number five goes in. He's now 5 of 12 from the floor. Y'all still don't have the lead. Okay. Don't be acting like you know how to do math, all right? Lead is still mine. It's always mine. Damn. They can look forward to the Rockets Arena after this matchup to take on Houston. That'll be the last game of their very short three-game road There we go. A natural board score. Ingram is a walking... Done playing with y'all. And he can beat you in so many ways. Here's DiVincenzo. After the basket by San Antonio. Shit. For New York, they have knocked down eight of nine free throw attempts. Yeah. Pretty well. And I think this is the script of this team. Solid numbers at the line across the board. 77% collectively. And that trip comes Dang, missed both. both. Okay. All of his Fuck. The defense got lucky there. Hard kicks to DiVincenzo. That doesn't go in. Had a chance, though, to take the lead. Here's Jones, and he could not get that one to go. Yes, sir. And he'll go to the line. 
second for two. These are his third and fourth free throw attempts of the game. Gordon Hayward's checked in for Ingram. Fuck. Three missed free throws now. Shit. Change here as well. Robinson's checked in for Hartenstein. And Greg, just like you, Julius Randle is a softball. Left-handed. No! Get that out of here. The angles are different for lefties. We operate a little differently. And I think that's... <laughs> so, I'm always going to pull. Big drum. Oh, taking it to the rack. Sam is power. Hammering down the two-hand slam. Oh, no, he's the last guy you want to put on the line. You can just about book the points every time he steps up. They're not doing themselves any favors with their free throw shooting this half. Jones, no luck. Knicks trail by five. One fifteen left here in the third quarter. And Fournier over to help. Even Chenzo passes to Randall. Five to shoot. New York needs to get off a shot. New York missing again. For three, Hayward. Robinson it in. Bam. Robinson's got his fourth rebound with that last one here tonight. Hart kicks to quickly. There's 39 seconds left in the third quarter. Robinson, that's good. I don't know what happened there. Two K cheese. Closer to crunch time. Fournier dishes to Jones. No good on the floor. Ah. And he's trying to shoot his way out of it. You know they have the lead, but honestly, I, I think it might help if you be a little bit more selective tonight. Spurs leading by three, and no need to rush this. Let the clock run down. Yeah, you don't have to be quick. You just have to be deliberate. Brooks misses. Randall surveying the D. That doesn't go on the chance to tie. Ooh. Dylan, what are you, what are you shooting at? It's all right. And who will be going after this from at and Center? 66. There's that block. One of them. Well, we have the chance now, folks. Let's go to our State Farm assist of the game. And he sliced the D wide open with this feed. They had no chance to permit that basket. That's an unguardable pass. Flat out. Give him credit for possessing that type of vision. I'm gonna throw D-Rose out there for a little bit. Here's how the floor looks for Greg Popovich. We've got Hayward, Fournier out there with Jones. Then there's Dylan Brooks. And it's What are you doing, Mitchell? Heading the middle. That's a shot he's gotta hit. You don't get many looks better from that right there. Fournier's uh. shot is off. Not quite enough defense. That time around, just lucky he was off. Brunson, no good. Spurs leading by three. Here's Truman, and he uses the glass on the way. Too small, Julius. I think that was Julius. I'm not sure. Might have been Barrett. Comfortable Truman is down there. Excels at using that size and close to the basket. And it's Jones with the ball for the Spurs. 13 points was their biggest lead in the game. Brooks for three. It's rebounded by New York. Robinson's got his fifth rebound right now in the game. And the shot is good. The Spurs lead has been cut down now to just three on the bucket from Brunson. And you see the passing instincts Barrett has. Great at recognition out on the floor. Hayward can hit. And they're Damn. right now, but it hasn't been because of him. He's really struggled on offense. And he dunks it down. Just the kind of play they need in a game this close. You know, that's the kind of aggression they want from their floor leader. No doubt. That's the kind of play that can energize the whole team. And they will take it in a close game like this. And the Spurs with possession. The Knicks making the shot. Out to Brooks. For three, Fournier. 
Here's Drummond, and it's Drummond with the jam. And that's a Y'all get two chances, then I'm dunking the motherfucker. <laughs> and 12 rebounds. And just a dynamic big man with it. Drummond frequently makes plays above the rim. Ingram, he's checked in for San Antonio. Rose comes in for Tyus Jones. Now, here's Bill. Derek Rose. And the pass to Brunson. Here's Hart. No good. That would have tied. And in transition, it's Ingram. Here we go. And the first one at the line is good. John Collins, he's checked in for San Antonio. Julius Randle's checked in for New York. Old free throws, good for Ingram. Fourth quarter of play, and we're about two and a half minutes through it right now. Brunson against Ingram. There at the pass to Randall over Brooks. And contact down the shot. So what? Shooting free throws here. <laughs> what? What happened there? No, 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 you, uh, yeah, no, 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 I don't know what that was. And this is the time now where the officials can review in closer detail what constituted the previous plays. Make it a lot easier to determine you think you're rondo that's a travel first of all when you see yeah he don't only have a pivot foot he was like get a new appreciation for just the immense speed at which these players man you know greg to make the right call don't call it travel okay and then i didn't even touch him and Whatever. It don't matter. It don't matter, Julius. Traveling bastard. David Aldridge. David. The guys during the last break, I listened to Greg Popovich talk to his team. He's rest beyond his key message was don't on something. Those guys are gonna come at us. You getting shook, sucker? P Rose, brother. Uh. Kevin, back to you. You, Give my two Dave, points back. I love watching Rose play the game. His intense style. Yes, sir. Infectious out there. I think it really does. Alonzo Ball, you need to hit up D Rose stat Rose on how he how he recovered and changed his game and shit. If you want to play again. Here's Robinson over Richardson. Good foul. Good foul. Make him shoot those free throws. He can't shoot them. Next trail by five. It's stolen by Rose. And a fast break now for the Spurs. Ingram finds Richardson. And that'll be two free throws coming up. Officials on the call with the foul. Second person. That's good from Richardson. And Richardson drops them both. New York's gone 0-3 so far in the fourth quarter from long range. Here's Brunson. Jams it in off the creek. Come on, Collins. That should give him a nice little What are you jump. doing? Uh, yeah, it has to. They need a jolt here. And they need more where that came from. They're not out of this hole yet. Drains it from beyond the arc. Ingram's got five points soon in the quarter. Silky three-point shot by Ingram. Just goes to the arc and knocks it down. Rose with the double team. There at the pass to Randall. And he can't answer back. The three-pointer offline. Richardson, that's a two-pointer. It's good. This time the assist from Rose. And it's a 10-point Spurs lead. And yes, it is. Lead, I like the strategy here. Continue to get the ball to guys who can do something with it. This is when good players really get after it. He can sense that they're reeling, and he's going to put his foot on the pedal. And now with two three-pointers in each half, he's really doing his all to help his team out from deep. Here's Collins. Robinson pulls it in. Robinson's got six rebounds in the game. Here's Grimes. Randall is screen on Richardson. The feed to Randall. Good D. Is off. 
Good work defensively by Richardson. Collins setting the pick for Richardson. Take it, Josh. Ow! Coming up, unable to get that one to go with all the content. It's on Mitchell Robinson. The first one fall. Some changes here for the Spurs. Andre Drummond's check in for John Collins. Porter comes in for Dylan Brooks. And Murray subbed in for Rose. New York calls timeout. Be right back. Here's Randall. Pass to Robinson. Shot from 12. That's in. Coming off an assist from Randall. Randall's got three assists tonight. They are just killing them on the interior. Unable to get the ball in bounds. They get called for the five second violation. Here's Brunson over Richardson. Brunson, no good. Now here's Drummond. And there's the eight-second call as they can't get it across half court in time. Yes. That's his first turnover of the game, and that only goes to show how well he's taking care of the ball to this point. And DeJounte Murray gets the whistle that time. This is not going that well. will be foul number five on him. Personal foul. 14 pounds. And being over the limit in the early really can affect your aggressiveness defensively. They have got to play under control. And guys, this is becoming the story of the second half. Missed free throws. You can't come back in a game if you can't make your foul shot. Now here's Murray. It's rebounded by New York. Robinson's got rebound number seven for him tonight. Randall passes to Brunson. He gets that one. Brunson. Brunson's got 14 points now in the second half. And of the last okay, six minutes, okay. five have come on the interior. This is just smash mouth physical basketball, guys. Gets the three-pointer to fall. Murray is capable of getting double-digit assists anytime he's on the floor because he is an unselfish point guard. Ryan. And the Knicks hit again from deep. And you can tell he's starting to figure things out here in the second half. Okay. <laughs> that happened. Ingram against Randall. Shoots. So did that, though. And the Spurs <laughs> score again. And obviously his momentum from the last game has carried over here tonight. He's just riding the wave of momentum right now, getting to his spots and keeping things simple on the offensive side. That's in there. Murray with the assist. Silky smooth. Murray's got four assists now tonight. And, and no one is catching Ingram in the open floor. This guy is like a rocket. Now here's Randall. Randall is doubled. Here's Barrett. No good on that one. Good D by Drummond. 
Murray kicks to Ingram. Back to Murray. Takes the three. And oh! Fuck! Fuck out the way! To the left side wing. Fuck you. New York, no good that time either. Spurs leading by 11. Ingram deciding where to go with it. They get it again. And Drummond kicks to Ingram. It's <laughs> up a three. Buries the long range. Finally. Ingram's got the lead up to 14 now for San Antonio. And this is Ingram's attitude. He's ready to fire away as soon as the ball hits his hand. Spurs making a switch here. Brooks checked in. In the corner, Barrett with it. No good. They had a chance to end the run there. It's Ingram on the wing. And slammed up by Ingram. And this is going to end in a lopsided victory. I love the tenacity and aggressiveness as well as the ability to close. You really got to give it up here for the Spurs. They made more foul shots, and that was the difference. That, that was a big advantage. The other team was to... Ah! Yes. They maintained focus all night and, and along the way put on quite a show. The opposition they they play a good game. I'll give them that. They, 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 they almost took a lead. Was so impressive, man. That was a good win. It got they dicey so times. Not dicey enough, though. They're gonna lose by 20, but it wasn't that. That wasn't that kind of game. <laughs> they just got bushwhacked here in the last minute. Brooks against Randall. Out to Barrett. Barrett has had a horrible game. And Murray's got the ball <clears> for San Antonio. They lead by 20. It's the most we've seen. Richardson for three. Good, and the assist goes to Murray. Saw the opportunity to put this away and did not turn it down. And that score probably slams the door for any would-be comebacks. And look, Josh they put this Richardson. one to bed. Yeah, that's a bad move there. Stops the clock and puts the other side on the line. And the first one drops. Quinton Grimes. Two both shots good from the strike. There's 21 seconds left in the fourth quarter of this one. Inside. Here's Truman. Makes it off the glass. They made the most of their opportunities looking comfortable and locked in throughout the night. Big drum! To love their effort. This game wasn't handed to them. They took it. Even Genzo passes to Roby. And so it's San Antonio easily taking this one. They won this game going away. They were the better basketball team by far tonight. And you got to commend this sort of dominance, particularly here at home. It's a great feeling when you play almost a perfect game and to have that crowd be so pumped up. And that about wraps it up. This is Kevin Harlan saying thank you for watching. Now let's check out our new balance player of the game. B.I. Kangaroo. MVP! 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 MV Splash! Bah! Yeah! Let's go! Alright, let's see what happened here. I even gave y'all two points because I took too long in the bathroom. I almost threw the ball over half court. Almost. <laughs> uh. 19 boards by Big Drum. Let's go. Three blocks, six of six. Plus 16. Four dunks. 14 points. Dealing with eight and nine. Kind of shot bad, but plus 20. See, I mean, there's a lot he does. That's not. He's like Draymond Green, kind of. Look at that. B.I. plus 40. Oh, that's, that's the most responsible for. <laughs> okay. Right, plus 17. All right. Sweet. Had knocked my boyfriend negative four. It's all right. Negative two for Hayward. I can see it. Oof, one and nine for Tyus. Shoot. Seven assists, two turnovers. Every time I get a turnover with Tyus, I feel so bad because he don't really be turning the ball over. But, like, 
two cages. Sometimes the angles are just so bad. Ten by Porter. Good three by him. Sixteen for Josh. Nice. Oh, great shooting night. Had some bad shooting nights with him lately, but not tonight. Murray with 15, 7, and 6. Sweet. Randall had a good game, mostly. Barrett, 2 of 7, man. What, what's up, bro? Brunson played hard. Lots of nice dunks there. Hart had some good looks. Yeah, they need... I mean, look at their bench. They really don't have anything. And, like, no one even knows if, like... Uh, Daquan Jeffrey, he's on non-guaranteed deal. Roby's on... I mean, it's just, like... I guess their cap is just locked up in RJ, Randall, and uh, I know Mitchell's got a decent contract. They gave Jalen that huge contract. I mean, Hart's a good player. I still like that. They extended him. He deserves that. But, uh, yeah, they, they got to do something. I would, I hate to say it, you got, I think you got to trade Randall. I would rather them trade Barrett, though. Barrett, I don't think they've given him, I think, one big contract. I mean, he he can score, but he's, I mean, he's not really killing it. I mean, they could probably get something for him. Um, and Mitchell Robinson, I mean, he's a traditional center, which, and he has trouble staying healthy. I mean, he probably won't get much in a trade. You're not going to trade Brunson, obviously. They don't really have anybody else. Quentin Grimes has been good. Quickly has been okay. Maybe you compare it quickly with uh, Ra with uh, Barrett in a trade. Or just say screw it and trade Randall. I mean, you could probably get something for Randall. Something decent, maybe a couple good players. But then who's your leader, RJ? I mean, you got Brunson. You got to gotta figure out who's good with Brunson because Brunson's only, what, 27? So, I mean, he's, he's enter just entering his prime. So, uh, is Randall the guy for him? I mean, I don't know. So... You got a lot of work to do, Nick's IRL, so figure it out. All right. 35-0. and 0, Let's go. Uh, like I said, we'll probably play another one here. We'll see. Got some moves to make a free agency first. But thanks for tuning in. It is appreciated. Um, everybody's welcome in the den. We'll, we'll be getting back to NBA here. Uh, I don't know who the hell we're playing next. Um, and then we'll maybe play something else. Maybe San Andreas. I got to check to see if anyone responded to that poll. Shitload of games I got planned, but it is what it is. Go Spurs, go MVP 33. Ingram.